So guys, look at my hair. It's not down and it's kind of weirding me out because I feel like I'm bald, but hi. <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a very special video and it's kind of like a TBT or like kind of like a back in the day video and it's like I'm so excited. I'm actually recreating my first makeup tutorial that I've ever done and this makeup tutorial was almost six years ago. Six. I feel old. I feel old. And I rewatched the video just to see which products I had to use. I have none of them. But we're going to recreate it as much as we can. The video thumbnail is right here. And as you can see, we did, we were not able to pick our thumbnails back then. You know, it was like filmed at 3 megapixels, you already know. Now I have like 10 million, I don't know how much we have on this camera. But it's kind of weird to me to see how everything has changed. If you're new to my videos and my channel, hi my name is Leslie and I make beauty and lifestyle videos. One quick fact about me is that I never wear my hair like this. This is like one of the few times you'll actually see my hair like this. Is that my hair was really dirty and we did not want to wash it today. If you want to see how I recreated my first ever makeup tutorial, you have to keep on watching. Without further ado, let's just get started. The video I'm referring to is my everyday makeup routine and like it's kind of cringy to look at because it was like literally five years ago, almost six years ago, but we don't gotta talk about that, right? I literally did like nothing. So what we're going to start off with is some moisturizer. The moisturizer I used was a clean and clear one, I believe. You know, I was 16, I was with that acne. I still have that acne, but we, we just don't care about it anymore. And all my makeup was drugstore before. I mean, all the makeup that I'm going to use today is all drugstore. I was listening to music and everything, girlfriend. I used makeup remover before actually doing my makeup there. And there was like no talking in the video. So it was all sped through. I don't know if that was like a thing that we were doing before or if it was only me. For foundation, my younger self used my Maybelline BB cream. I think that was the only thing that I had. I think I had um, a L'Oreal foundation, but I used the Maybelline BB cream because this was us summer makeup routine or like an everyday makeup routine but i used the maybelline bb cream right there but i'm going to use the wet and wild um photo focus foundation because it is the least coverage foundation that i have in my collection right now this i could use a little bit of like on the cheeks and on the forehead and everywhere else i could just blend it in with my big giant beauty blender to make it sheer out so it could actually look like bb cream Kind of looks like I'm not wearing anything, but that's okay. That's how we did our makeup before. I actually kind of miss, but kind of don't miss the YouTube back in the day. It is what it is. It has evolved. It has made people stars. It has made um a lot of people great. Next, I use a stick concealer, which is one of the things I would never use now. So the concealer I'm actually using to replace it is my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Light. It is like a light coverage concealer, so I'm just using this on my under eyes. I actually didn't buy seal I believe so we now hold a spot conceal today we're recreating so <laughs> and like YouTube back then was really 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 like judge free and like amazing but it's okay it's okay we evolve and we use clickbait now so the next thing my little self used was um, a L'Oreal true match powder I don't have that anymore I used that a long time ago the closest powder that I have is actually in the wet and wild contouring palette it is this light shade right here and I don't think this is supposed to go all over your face but this is the only pressed powder that I could use all over my face and it actually matches kind of matches it's like translucent almost so it works it doesn't make me look like a crazy hooligan so if i was a little bit darker then i wouldn't have used this but i'm in my winter shade i use this under my eyes and everywhere else apparently and i'm actually glad that i actually did my eyebrows today my sister did them for me do i look like a new person next i used a black eyeliner because black eyeliner was a thing i used a wet and wild eyeliner pencil but i only have this so we gonna use these Now that we did our black eyeliner, we have to use white eyeliner in the inner corners. That was like the whole thing five years ago and I can't, can't believe it because now we actually use shadows in the inner corner. But we're going to put this in our inner corner. This is the Sivali pencil eyeliner. I think my sister got it on a dollar website. I don't know. We just put this in the inner corner. 
like so we don't even blend it out and then on to the other side as well because you know we gotta be equal but now we are going to use mascara before i used the maybelline rocket mascara because that was like a big thing and i just bought everything that the youtubers bought so i think it was 16 like why was i being so stupid 16 year olds are so different now even 14 year olds weren't like my 16 year old self i'm not even doing speedy videos anymore this would be the time where we actually do our this would be the time where we actually do our brows but apparently i wasn't doing my brows before so we just brushed them through literally just brushed them through and it was fine that's why no one liked me when i was 16 but at least my eyebrows are done so they don't look that bad and the last thing i did use was some lip balm but i don't really have lip balm anymore but i came close to a color like this it's kind of like a color like this it's kind of like a hot pink color that i actually use but this is as close that i could get so we're going to use this milani lipstick in rose femme kind of looks like it actually nice going leslie we doing good the last thing i put on was like a ballistic medicated lip balm on but we don't got that so we're going to be using the nivea lip butter in vanilla macadamia kiss so it could be a little bit shiny you know my everyday makeup look <laughs> just to know that back then i was a really different person it seemed crazy to me and to know that i actually did a makeup look and actually came out the house like this was kind of like crazy because now i come out the house with like no makeup on i don't really care like noble thing no so that's literally the end of my makeup look literally that's what i did to my little 16 year old self did this makeup look in my old little room i miss it if you liked reminiscing with me please leave a comment down below or if you actually try to recreate your looks from many many years ago please recreate them as well and send me pictures on instagram twitter or facebook i don't really use facebook don't don't tag me on name so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up or a million thumbs up and if you want to subscribe to my channel hit the subscribe button right here or hit the bell notifications button so you can get notified every time i upload a new video i'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.